It's 10 o'clock. That's the time that was noticed and posted for several meetings that we have today. So we're going to uh, begin. Um, the, the first will be the um, light improvement districts. We're going to look at the final budgets of the special districts, the light improvement districts. Did you wish to have um, yourself or uh, Mr. Frisbee go over any of the information before I open up that meeting? I know we're trying to find uh, Mrs. Judd. She isn't with us, but supposedly she will come online at some point. We're just getting a recording from her, so that's why you'll hear her popping in every once in a while. Can you take a 15 minute recess? Okay, um, I think that that would certainly be appropriate. We haven't opened up anything yet. And so uh, we're trying to uh, locate Ms. Judd. She's um, on the line somewhere. And, and so if you'll give us, um, uh, let's set a time instead of saying 15 minutes. Let's do it at uh, 1015. Would that work? Okay, 1015. We'll be back in session. Those of you that are online, um, we feel it's necessary in order to have a complete board if possible, so thank you. It's 10.15, and that's the time that I rescheduled the beginning of this meeting today. We do have several meetings. The um, Board of Supervisors serves as the district board for the uh, light improvement districts, the Bowie Light, Golden Acres, Naco, Hurtleville, Sun Sites, and I'm going to convene all of these district meetings simultaneously. Um, this is, excuse me, Tuesday, July the 9th, 2024. It's 10.15. We're in the Board of Supervisors Executive Conference Room, Melody Lane, Bisbee. Pursuant to ARS 38-431.02H, the public will have physical access to the meeting place 15 minutes prior to the start of the meeting. Any item on this agenda is open for discussion and possible action. And we begin with the roll call. District 1. Crosby is here. District 2. Supervisor English is present. District 3. Can you make it so we hear her more? Uh, she said Supervisor Judd is here. So we have a complete board this morning. Uh, pursuant, uh, excuse me, members of the uh, Cochise County Board of Supervisors may attend either in person or by telephone. And as you can tell, we have Ms. Judd on the phone this morning. Members of the public may also attend this meeting by Microsoft Teams computer or mobile app or by phone by calling 602-609-7513 or 888-680-6714. Conference ID 581-873-138 pound. If you have trouble accessing this meeting remotely, call 520-432-9200 for direction. The board may permit public comment during the discussion of any item on the agenda. To speak on an agenda item, complete and return the speaker request form to the clerk of the board prior to the start of the meeting. And we begin the light improvement district with the consent agenda, which is only one item. Madam Chair, I move we approve the consent agenda number one. You say it again. I'll second it. Thank you. I have a motion and a second. All those in favor say aye. Aye. Chair votes aye and it's unanimous and approved. We now move to the public hearings. Uh, did you wish to make a statement, Mr. Karwatska? Oh, sorry. Move the microphone real quick. So just really quickly, uh, none of the budgets have changed from tentative budget to the final budget. And just overall, as you previously mentioned, that these are uh, all improvement districts that we just pay for the lighting bill. Okay, having said that, and the, the procedure will be all these are public hearings. Uh, but I don't believe it's appropriate to open all public hearings at the same time. So I'll have a, a motion, and then we'll open the, the first one, which is Bowie Light. Madam Chair, item number two, adopt the I, I move we adopt the final budget of the Bowie Light Improvement District for fiscal year 24, 2024 to 2025 in the amount of $13,031. Second. Was there a second? There was a, Peggy, we couldn't hear you. Can you second it?
I'm picking up. Okay, can you hear me now? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I'll second that. Okay. Um, we have a motion and a second. I'm going to open up the public hearing uh, for the buoy light. Seeing no one who wishes to speak, I'll close the um, public hearing and ask for a, a vote. All those in favor say aye. 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 Chair votes aye and it's unanimous and approved. Could I have a motion for Golden Acres? Item number three, Madam Chair, I move we adopt the final budget of the Golden Acres Light Improvement District for fiscal year 2024 to 2025 in the amount of $8,117. Okay, we have a motion and a second, so I'll open up the public hearing for Golden Acres Light Improvement District. I have no requests, see none, hearing none, then I'll close the public hearing and ask for a vote. All those in favor say aye. Aye. <coughs> Chair votes aye and it's unanimous and approved. Peggy, can we hear your vote? Okay, it's recorded now. All right, so it's unanimous and approved. We move on to item number four. Could I have a motion? Item number four, Madam Chair, I move we adopt the final budget of the NACO Light Improvement District for fiscal year 24, 2024 to 2025 in the amount of $11,060. Okay, I heard a second. So we have a motion and a second, so I'm going to open up the public hearing on the NACO Light Improvement District. I see you. Yes, would you like to step forward to the microphone, give your name and address, please? Oh. And you have three minutes. Hi, I'm Emily Vardaman. I live at 3711 South Rogers in NACO. I'm wondering if this is going to be a new line item in our tax bill. Um, we don't normally um, address things that we don't understand so i'm gonna i'm gonna ask the that you contact the county administrator because they'll he'll have to work with the treasurer who puts out the tax bill she's the one that okay. puts the information on the tax bills okay thank okay. you you're welcome anyone else okay we'll uh close the public hearing and we have a motion so i'll call for the vote all those in favor say aye aye Chair votes aye and it's unanimous and approved. Item number five. Madam Chair, I move we adopt the final budget of the Pertleville Light Improvement District for fiscal year 2024 to 2025 in the amount of $24,744. Second that. Okay, I have a motion and a second, so I'll open the public hearing for the Pertleville Light Improvement District. I don't have any requests. Does anyone wish to speak for or against? Hearing none, then I'll close the public hearing and call for the vote. All those in favor say aye. 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 Chair votes aye and it's unanimous and approved. Item number six for a motion, please. Madam Chair, I move we adopt the final budget for the Sun Sites Light Improvement District for fiscal year 2024 to 2025 in the amount of $32,394. I'll second it. Okay, I have a motion and a second, so I'll open the public hearing for the Sun Sites Light Improvement District. I don't have any requests to speak, but if there's anyone in the crowd to speak for or against, hearing none, then I'll close the public hearing and call for the vote. All those in favor say aye. Aye. Chair votes aye and it's unanimous and approved. Um, no further business. Next meeting is for the library. <laughs>